What's up guys, it is Ethi, and in this video I'm going to be asking and answering one question. Should vegans date non-vegans? So firstly, I'm sorry for the lighting in this video, it's like bright and early in the morning, it's 9am, and yeah, there's a window right here. You know, don't ask me why I chose to make like a, you know, video making area um, in front of a fucking window, or with a, you know, window behind me, but yeah, it is what it is. It kind of looks aesthetic, as you can see, like the sunlight beam or whatever but yeah this is a very important question um because this is something a lot of vegans struggle with and i'll just say right now i don't personally think it's a fucking problem to date a non-vegan i think this whole issue has been blown out of proportion by some vegans and this is and i'll talk about some of that later in the video it makes no fucking sense to judge someone for dating a non-vegan or to see them as any less of a vegan because it's like look Unless you're buying, like, your non-vegan partner um, some non-vegan things and that sort of thing, I don't see how you dating them really does anything. Um, I don't see how it disadvantages animals, if anything. I, I only see benefits for the animals and for veganism as a movement because while you're dating someone, you know, they have a much higher likelihood of, of going vegan unless you're doing something which, you know, antagonizes them about it and it makes them resent you and actually not want to go vegan. And in that case, why the fuck are you even doing that in the first place? You know, you could have, um, you know, done, you know, uh, deployed a better method and then they actually would have gone vegan or it was more likely that they would have gone vegan um but yeah there's no like correlation with like fucking um yeah now you're gonna start eating meat because your partner is like not vegan or um like um, they're gonna be more non-vegan because you're with them or anything like that. So I really don't see where this argument is coming from where, you know, it's an act of immorality to, um, date a non-vegan. The only argument I've ever heard for it to be bad to date a non-vegan would be like, oh, well, look at it from the animal's eyes. And then they try to, like, compare it to, like, Nazis. Like, oh, imagine how a not or a, imagine how a, you know, a Jew would feel in the Holocaust if you were dating a Nazi. And it's like, these are very fucking different things. The difference is, um, as far as I know, animals can't fucking conceptualize that. If they could conceptualize that, I'm not even sure if they'd care. I mean, if they're anything like humans, they probably would. But the, the point is, they don't. They don't have that value. They don't have the value of, oh, I don't want you to date my abuser or whatever. Um, yeah, they don't have that fucking value, and, and as far as I know. And before anyone tries to flip this on me and be like, oh, well, they don't have the value for a lot of things that you're against, you know, having been done to them. And it's like, no, uh, they are against dying, okay? They do not want to fucking die. So even if you could kill them humanely, that still goes against what they're valuing, right? And, and so they don't fucking value, or like I said, I'm at least unconvinced that they value, um, you know, you not dating their fucking abuser. So it's a complete, you know, false equivalence to say that, you know, they're similar in any fucking way. They can't conceptualize that. And you shouldn't look at it from the standpoint of like, oh, well, what if they could conceptualize it? No, the point is they don't. That's like saying, oh, well, what if I do, or what if I did value, I don't know, um, the book right here, um, when in reality I don't, so then I think it's morally acceptable for someone to just burn my book, and then you're saying, okay, well, what if he cared about it? Well, the point is I don't, so what the fuck is your point? Yeah, if I cared about it, you shouldn't burn it, but I don't care about it, so it doesn't fucking matter. Um, and yeah, <laughs> that's basically what I think about it. And, uh, the person who really, you know, uh, gave me the idea for this video, um, is actually, I'm sorry if, you know, <laughs> the thing just buzzed because I just got a Discord uh, notification, now I'm on silent. But, um, yeah, the person who gave me the idea for this video was Mizuki99. Uh, he made a post on his Instagram, and it was like, oh yeah, if you date non-vegans, you're not vegan. And, um, you know, just saying all this sort of shit. And people were agreeing with him. People were like, oh, wow, yeah, I've never thought about this. He's like, look at it from the victim's point of view. And this is why I brought up that argument of like, oh, well, what if they could conceptualize it? Because this is like a big fucking steel man. Because um, in reality, he didn't provide any fucking evidence that animals actually do value that. I think that's um, way, way um, outside of the fucking common knowledge. So, yeah. Um, but, 
Yeah, and then he got really fucking pissed at me when I was, like, texting him about it, and I was like, no, this is counterproductive. Don't be telling people that they can't date whoever the fuck they want. Like, look, it, even though I'm fine with you dating, like, whoever the fuck you want, as long as you're not, like, buying them meat, you're not facilitating them eating more meat, you know, um, there needs to be a level of discouragement, obviously. It, it's not just some, like, oh, yeah, you can eat it whenever you want. You can just come put it in my fridge. You can blah, 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 blah. It's like, no, you can do some things to discourage that and I think you just not dating them you know that wouldn't necessarily do anything to make them go vegan you know not necessarily doing anything good and like I said if anything there's only benefits that could arise from that even though there isn't really any inherent downsides to dating a non-vegan I have dated uh, two non-vegans in the past and let me just say I would not recommend it for any vegan that's like me um, it's very fucking uncomfortable to see someone you love to be eating those sorts of fucking things and doing things that you think are very immoral. It's kind of like, let's say you're in love with someone and then you go out and they call a black person the N-word. Um, it's like, just like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, what am I doing with you? It's like, why am I settling for someone when I could be with someone who is not doing these fucking immoral things? And this is something I have struggled with in my life. And, you know, I've realized that, wow, like, I can't, uh, just date like a normal teenager like I don't fucking like these people like a normal like teenage guy would um, uh, Yeah, I just got to settle for fucking vegans or not settle like the opposite of settle But yeah, I, I just feel like I'd be a lot happier with a vegan So if you're any me anything like me, it's probably not a good idea to date a non-vegan um uh, but yeah, I'm not sure how many vegans are really like that. I know a few people who, at the very least, they agree with me on, like, ethics and that sort of thing, even if they aren't completely vegan, so technically they don't agree with me 100%, uh, but, you know, they agree with me mostly, and they're dating someone who's, like, not vegan, they don't give, like, half of a fuck. That, that kind of makes me question their sincerity, but, yeah, I, I do think it could be possible they actually do care, but they just don't care if their fucking boyfriend or girlfriend does it. But, yeah... Uh, in conclusion and kind of a in summary I don't think there's anything inherently wrong with dating a non-vegan but um, yeah there could be downsides if you're anything like me if you don't like seeing your partner eat flesh and you don't want to lick the flesh strings out of their teeth but yeah basically at the end of the video make sure to like comment subscribe check out the discord and yeah have a nice day or night everybody